A military exercise ends in tragedy on the Tiwis. Our thoughts are with them and their families back in the United States and want to reassure them that we'll give them that care. 23 US Marines were on board an Osprey aircraft when it crashed near Picataramore on Melville Island, sending emergency services into action. This is a, a difficult incident. Uh, we're responding fully and our priority uh, is on providing every assistance possible. Helicopters and aeroplanes have been in full force, transporting patients with the National Critical Care and Trauma Response Team triaging on the ground. Right now our focus is getting them from a very remote location to a hospital at Royal Darwin. The incident putting the hospital under significant strain, even forcing other patients to relocate to free up space. We have declared a code brown at Royal Darwin Hospital. A code brown is a management tool within the health system to acknowledge an external incident will have an impact. The Marines were participating in Predators Run, an annual exercise involving 2,500 personnel from the US, Australia, Philippines, Timor-Leste and Indonesia. But only United States personnel were involved in the crash. The Australian Defence Force are cooperating with our friends in the United States Defence Force uh, to make sure that we provide every assistance possible. Exercise Predators Run will be paused while emergency evacuations continue and a decision on if it will resume will be made at a later date. Roxanne Fitzgerald, ABC News.